somebody call a doctor because bad medicine is back. back over there's diamond dave damone this is the appleton oak that's the answer i'm mason quinn guys tonight we are taking a look at ant-man and the wasp quantum mania this one had a ton of hype about it and for me paul rudd's the guy in the marvel universe where i'm like it's gonna be all right paul rudd's like a nice <laughs> calming uh force in the in the mcu for me so i think we're gonna be all right in this one paul rudd the man that knows no age he looks exactly the same as he did in clueless uh got the handy marvel encyclopedia hopefully i can get some help with it nothing on quantum mania unfortunately in it we might need but it <laughs> ant-man 2 right here with scott lang so i am definitely ready willing and able to see where this one goes to uh, you know, Ant-Man, the, 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 the hero character, isn't my favorite superhero, but I love Paul Rudd. <laughs> so it's like this like weird, like, I don't love, you know, I, he's not Iron Man or the Hulk or Thor, but I love Paul Rudd. So these are, uh, these are always fun movies, so I'm really excited. Well, it seems like either you loved it or you hated it. Uh, uh, so I, mean, I have no expect expectations coming in right now. I just hope... At minimal, I'm entertained, so I'll just go off of that. So that being said, let's go! Yeah, that's what I thought it was, there Michelle Pfeiffer. Whoa. Oh. Oh. Ooh. Ooh see those Catwoman reflexes. Yeah. Oh, like there we that. go. Fancy seeing hey. you here. Kang the Conqueror. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome back, Cotter. Is that what we're going to get? song from Welcome Back, Cotter. <laughs> Welcome There's back. our guy. There he is. My life uh, doesn't really make sense. <laughs> I used to ask myself a lot of questions about that. Scott, you're a divorced ex-con. How are you an Avenger? <laughs> <laughs> because if there's one thing life's taught me, there's always room to grow. <laughs> oh my God, all the cliches. <laughs> every, every How do you not person. love Paul Rudd? This guy's great. What if you lost it? I didn't lose the suit. You have a suit? Wait, you have a suit? <laughs> Trust me, Whoops. I'm pretty good at it by now. Ouch. Ouch, that hurts. No pizza in the quantum realm. <laughs> No, no anything. You can talk about it. I spent 30 years down there. Okay, so that was the, like a, yeah, before. Yeah. Got it now. <clears throat> but 30 years. And I started reading Grandpa Hank's old journals, and I got really into the quantum realm. And I know we all have a history there, and I didn't want to freak anyone out, but we've been talking about it. She has some questions, okay? I can't help if people are inspired by me. <laughs> <laughs> Your daughter built a subatomic Hubble telescope in a basement. It's amazing. I'm blown away. But stop. Does it work? No, nope, no. Nope. No, nope. don't, don't let them touch the, it. The stop. You send a signal down from here, and then it collects the data and it sends it back. And wait, wait a minute. You're sending uh -oh. a signal down to the quantum realm. She does not like it. Yeah. Shut it down now. Shut what's it wrong? Down. You have to turn it off. Stop and tell us what's wrong. Uh-oh. There's something I should have told him. Oh, no. Oh, shit. Even without Is this power. Kang? Oh, no. Uh, I guess part of me wonders, like, how did she not know it was sending a signal, you know? Yeah. But. Uh-oh. It's going to suck him in. Well, this isn't going to be good. Oh, what? Uh, yeah, it doesn't matter what uh, you hold on to. I think uh, you're going in. <laughs> Oh, the oh, ants! Oh, no, not all the ants! So we know that's coming into play later. Yep, it's gotta. Oh, they're both? <laughs> oh. Smart. Might as well take the suit on and go. Oh, oh. I thought he was gonna bust through it. Yeah. There you go. Suit up! Oh, it's just gonna miss. Oh, oh you got her. Goes. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Kevin, the old double forearm. Can anyone hear me? Oh my god. It's okay. What are we gonna do? It's okay. It's okay. We're okay. okay. You're saying okay too much. Yeah. 
Okay. What is it's, this guy? What is this? Star Wars? <laughs> yes. Quantum people in the quantum realm. We can talk about We don't have time to talk. You need to tell us. And why didn't you listen? I told you to stay away from here. I should have told you what we were doing. I had no idea. I know. It's. We'll talk later. Later? You got nothing but time. Yeah. Can we walk and talk? But why won't, if this place is so dangerous, it's kind of important to maybe say something now. Yeah, like, at hey, least a tidbit. Like, hey, don't touch these or whatever. I mean, she's been hyper in it. There are worlds here. Worlds within worlds. It's a place outside time and space. It's a secret universe beneath ours. The upside down? Yeah. That's the guy from earlier, right? Gotta be. Nope. <laughs> not Definitely <even> not. <laughs> Oh, took an arm off. He regenerates. Not, not for long, though. <laughs> oh. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> the reaction as well. He's friendly. These will help us blend in. What do you mean? Those clothes don't... <laughs> We're not too far from an old friend of mine. If anyone's heard where Scott and Cassie are, it'll be him. Saddle up, Ant-Man. Oh, oh, she called him Ant-Man. Oh, he can understand him now. Did you drink the ooze? Why can I understand you? Hey, everybody, it worked. Ooze worked. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> That's why Cassie was saying drink it. Yeah. You come from above like him. So he is hunting you. He will burn the world to find you. Who? The Conqueror. Mm, is she Kane. from Walking Dead, Dave? No. Real brief? Nope. She looks pretty jacked up. Yeah, huh? she, I thought she was in Z Nation, but could All be wrong. Right. Guys, help me out if she's been in some other stuff. Yeah, definitely not Walking Dead, though. <clears throat> well, she wasn't as buff from what I No, I, I, 99% percent sure she was Jesus look at that drop oh you gotta do the water skim always how to train your flying stingray you know the one person that seems pretty important in the MCU is Hank so hopefully nothing uh, happens to him yeah. in this film I mean I mean look what everything he's been creating since with uh, Iron Man's dad yeah. so uh -huh. name slipping me right now I should know <clears throat> what Hank Pym Tony Stark. Oh, Howard. Howard. The subatomic universe. This changes everything we know about life, evolution, our place in the galaxy. Holy shit. <laughs> <laughs> it looks like broccoli. <laughs> <laughs> Man, they got security and everything down here. Literally a whole nother world. Yeah. How exactly do you know this guy? Old uh, freedom fighter, friend of mine. You were a freedom fighter? Or terrorist depends on who you ask. <laughs> that guy looked like a chia pet. <laughs> well, I thought they had some interesting creatures in Guardians of the Galaxy. Mm. Oh, we have these guys. Was this Dead Mouse coming to? Uh, Janet Van Dyne. Oh, oh, oh come on! Come on. <laughs> Bill Murray, are you serious? <laughs> are you serious? That is awesome. I had no idea. No. You have got to be Hank. I've heard <laughs> so much about you and your ants. What <laughs> are ants? Anyway, do we have them down here? <laughs> I don't think so, no. You have to be. Oh, she talked about you every day. Strange, she never said anything about you. <laughs> <laughs> Conqueror burned our homes, our stories. He built his citadel on the bones of our people. Some of us escaped, found others on the run. We gathered who we could to fight. It's never enough. We can help. Ah, uh, Cassie. Dad, you're an Avenger. <laughs> so what is it that brings you to us, Janet? If I remember correctly, you left with him. 
Jana, what is he talking about? You didn't tell them about him. She hasn't said anything yet. Yeah. <laughs> Does your family even know who you are? Oh. Technically, probably not. <laughs> no. Just give him what he wants. We fought against him. Let's pay him a visit. I think we're done here. Just waiting for the signal. <laughs> that kicks Bill Murray. <laughs> oh, 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 no! Is it gonna no, eat Bill Murray? No. Oh no! Oh no! no. Oh, no. Oh, no. He yeah. threw him. Yeah. What the hell? It's, it's like the great. abyss. It's like flying a bike. Is the bike alive? <laughs> Hands all the way in, like stuffing a turkey. <laughs> I like how everything is like kind of organic, kind of uh, mechanical. Take as many as you can. We'll hold them all. See, I have no idea who the bad guy even is here. Yeah, yeah I don't either. I'm right there with you. Well, you saw him in the beginning. You know what? Right. It's right. interesting because we should have made you watch the low key series first. Yeah. So that's probably our bad. Uh, yet here we are. I'll be okay. We got Paul Rudd to keep us company. We'll be fine. Not all of us have a Marvel encyclopedia. That's, <laughs> that's true. Yeah, I might as well flip it to King the Conqueror right now. But maybe we still have you guys watch Loki series because then what you see here might help out. Maybe. Oh, makes sense. Let us know in the comments. Well, well Janet was pretty wrong. clear about that, gentlemen. Just saying. Hmm. Doesn't... uh. Cassie have a suit right now? She must not. Well, she said she does have one, but I don't she know. She might not have her. it on. Yeah. yeah. I don't know if it's with her. Give up the travelers. The pilgrim will show you mercy. I know she's mercy. <laughs> have mercy. I wonder what she power cleans. Could... She looks like a crossfitter. Cassie! Must be. Who asked? Oh, what she, she does have her suit. What she power cleans. <laughs> what? I don't know. Shintora, we have to go. Yeah, I don't think it's going to matter. Oh. Whoa. Is that a what is that? What is oh. this? Oh, no. Oh, oh Morda. What the hell? The day you broke me. <laughs> oh, you oh. made him super small. Darren? <laughs> no <laughs> way. To see me. Oh, look at that. Oh, what the hell? You're still hiding things from us. Yes. To protect you. From what? What are you so afraid of? <laughs> I mean, does it really matter if she says anything? Like, what? Yeah, I'm, I'm confused on that. I don't know. Keeping them in the dark. I'm not is... trying to hate on it. I'm just yeah. confused as to... why, if you know or don't know, like, he's or... coming after you one way or another. Yeah. <laughs> you left Darren to die in the quantum realm, but the Conqueror found me, rebuilt me, made me the ultimate weapon, a mechanized <laughs> organism oh. designed only for kill well, Modok. A mo Oh, I get it. It's an <laughs> acronym. <laughs> It's an acronym. Mechanized organism designed only for killing. It, actually, that's Modofk. <laughs> I'm noticing baby legs. <laughs> baby legs. <laughs> what is this place? He said he was a traveler, a scientist who crashed off course. Something of a scientist myself. <laughs> I knew it was coming. He had a ship. A ship that could travel the multiverse. Uh huh. Mm. He felt so lost. We tried everything to recharge his ship's energy core. That's the last thing I did. It was lighter. I just thought I'd have more time. I can give that to you. Time. Okay, so the way they're setting this up makes me want to believe she did something to mess, screw him over in some way. We brought it back to life. Could be really wrong. Mm. <clears throat> Otherwise, why she, would she fear him? I mean, they have a his decent relationship right here. Yeah. Connected to his thoughts. Is there uh, room for two on that? When or? I touched it, 
I saw his mind. Oh. There's my answer. <laughs> yep, Ooh. there you go. He saw who he really was. There he is. Entire worlds. Entire timelines gone. Wow. He didn't crash here. He was exiled here. By who? I don't know. But they sabotaged his ship and trapped him here. And you mm. fixed it. Let me take you home. And then, what are you going to do? Win. Oh, oh geez. That's pretty cool uh, right there. Uh, oh, he's turning into a, his costume. Oh, there it is. Can't let you leave. Why do you think you could stop me? There it is. Full. Oh, boy. No! Oh. Oh. He's got weapons and technology centuries beyond anything we can dream of. He took his prison and made it his empire. Oh, look at that. Wow, wow. Back. Stop him together. He's after the core, but he needs pim particles to reach it. And if he's got Scott and Cassie, he's got pim particles. And a head start, exactly. We gotta get out of here. Hope. He cannot get out. Here we go. Mm -hmm. Oh, there he is. You're an interesting man. Scott Lang. See his eyes change color? Yeah. Mm hmm Bullock tells me you're a good thief. Yeah, he stole something from me. <laughs> that face. What's coming? A lot of me. But I'm the man who can get you home. Do we have a deal? No, I don't think we do. She's going to say yes, isn't she? No, he's going to hurt him or hurt her. You will bring me what I need. Or I will kill your daughter in front of you. Then make you relive that moment over and over again in time. Endlessly. Until you beg me to kill you. Don't do this. I am a man who likes to be understood. Oh, wow. Ooh. I'll do it. Just let her go. Let her go. Let her go. Oh, it's rough on his shoulder. This dude is a badass. Holy shit. Where is it? Huh, just go through that wormhole that I just made. Someone help me in the comics. Does Modoc look like that in the comic? I'm curious. Uh, more like how the mask was. Yeah, with the mask. the mask. Let me see it. Yeah. Dave. It's basically the same. Just not with the cartoonish human head on it. Yeah. Well, that's that's what I mean. Like yeah. under the yeah, mask, is that how it is? It's so. a mixture of the mask and the face. Yeah. Still, let me know. <clears throat> yeah. You'll have to shrink down and pass through the eye of the storm. Once you're inside, <laughs> I can't. <laughs> with why am I looking at another me? I'm not another me. You're another me. You just came out. Why am I looking at another me? You're looking at the possibility of another you. <laughs> <laughs> You're the real one. Oh, guys, hey, relax. Take it easy. Breathe. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> what the hell? Remember, he's employee of the month. Yeah. So. Employee of the century. <laughs> that was that. That's what it was. It says Jack. Why are you dressed like that? You have ice cream. <laughs> Is you have ice cream? I've got a read on Scott. Oh no, so now uh, the same thing's gonna happen to her. Hey, but she has no idea. Well, no, something no. else might happen to her. You don't know. Dad. Just come back. Don't give up. Come on, come on, let them. Yes, quiet. Come on, come on. Come on, come on. Give him a boost. I uh, kind of like the ants. Oh, nice. Yeah. Well, like human tower, like ants. We all want the same thing. And I'm Tom and Cassie. Oh, like an ant hill. That's nice. a lot of what's them. going on. That's. 
Go get her, pal. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, tower's looking wobbly. Jesus, look at how many look there are now. Yeah. I'm oh, sorry, buddy. Uh, well, it didn't work. Just fried the thing. Yep. Hope, are you real? I'm real. Then let's do this. Whoa. You ready? Ready. Oh, I use a bunch of them. Well, she was, uh, Mommy used what, four? Yeah. Oh, four of them. No, to they don't know what they're doing. They don't oh. know what they're doing. Well, she might. <laughs> What's it going to be, Scott? Oh, he found him. <laughs> Darren? <laughs> Protege again, after Holy all. Holy shit, Darren. <laughs> <laughs> I am the ultimate weapon! Those look like grappling hooks. They look like yeah, grappling yeah, hooks. Let's see how they do. Oh, is he going to make her watch the possibilities? Oh, it's the ants. Hank's ants? Yep, it was. Uh, oh, yeah, that's right. Because remember, yeah, they, remember were they were coming down, down yeah, in. Yeah, that's right. The ant farm broke. You'll be wiping out entire timelines, murdering trillions of people. I wish that mattered, Janet. Wow, guy's pretty cold. God, he's more harsh than Thanos. Oh! oh. <laughs> Are these your ants? In the ant farm? Yes, Scott, they're my ants. How did you find them down here? I've been picking up strange signals ever since we crashed. Ah, First, I okay. thought maybe it was a malfunction, some kind yep. of interference, but it wasn't. That was the it was the ants. It was, their, it was the ants. With their helmets on and everything, they have different. Yeah. They have a totally different. Apparently, they pass through some sort of time dilation. They live thousands of years in a single day, expanding their knowledge. Oh, so holy they, they shit. Yeah. <laughs> I don't care what he can do, I'm getting Cassie. So, how do we even the odds against Kane? We've got some ideas. What are you thinking? Well, as a great writer once said, there's always room to grow. <laughs> you read my book? Every goddamn book. <laughs> Does this thing have like a like a key or a card? Like a room key? You know, like a shit. <laughs> yeah, oh, she did it wrong again. Yeah. There, there you, you go. Jump it up. She's learning. Yep, she's getting there. Sorry I got your people hurt. How can I help? Let's hurt him back. Damn, you're cool. <laughs> <laughs> I built an empire down here, Janet. And I'm taking it with me. Oh, wow. It's just even... That's just that's the... the a lot. A tidbit right there. I mean, look at all that background. Mm -hmm. I know it might feel like it's too late. Like, all we do is just lose. But the family I've lost taught me to keep fighting. And if they were here, they would too. We need to look out for the little guy. That's <laughs> <laughs> my dad need help. The broccoli, broccoli guy. man. I know you've been waiting. Now is the time to strike. He knows he can't take all of us. I think I found the signal. Mom's got to be there too. Let's go. I'll drive. <laughs> <laughs> Find Lang's daughter. Kill her. 
check. I can't <laughs> those legs. I can't with that thing. <laughs> go, let it go. If you want to fight, follow me. Come with me if you want to live. Free the others. We've come full circle with this one. Uh, yeah. He's gonna see us coming. Yeah. I'll make sure of it. Darren versus Cassie. <laughs> 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 And look at what he built there now. Yep. You know, they never show all the factories where, like, he had to make yeah. the steel and the glass and the, the rubber <laughs> and the leather and everything. I mean. Oh, they're all <laughs> off-site. <laughs> Contracted. Yeah, contractors. It's not here, Cassie. But I guess that's not a big surprise. I think uh, someone just made himself incredibly big. Yeah. Yes, he did. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, really, really big. Yeah. Uh, that's just got to be as big as we've ever seen it. Yeah, I think so. You took my daughter! Holy shit. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, this is the biggest we've ever seen him, right? Yeah. Well, yeah. Got to be. Yeah, I mean, he was big at the airport in Civil War, but, but now not he's not and, and, I mean, <laughs> he's just... Yeah. It's our fun! And he like, got that big, you know, for the... End game fight. Yeah. Yes, yep. End looking, game two. He's looking like Godzilla. Keep going. I've got them. <laughs> it's like uh, he's hundreds. just swiping them. <laughs> hey, hey, it's all the burning oh, buildings. buildings. They look like the aliens from The Simpsons. <laughs> <laughs> Krang and <Yeah>. King. <laughs> Come on, let's go. <laughs> Look at the one running. Burn it all down. Burn it down. Oh, those things look serious. Oh, she is a badass. What is the bridge code? I'll die first. 18147. <laughs> <laughs> Damn. <laughs> <laughs> He's still running. <laughs> Has he even touched another like first thing yet? You don't need this. This is our home. Let's take it back. <laughs> That can't be good. Oh. Does it regenerate? I have holes. <laughs> I have holes. Oh. Oh, wow. Oh, he's <laughs> sucking them in. Oh, what? <laughs> who saw that? I didn't know he could do that. <laughs> <laughs> the guy who can read his mind didn't Come even know. On, you know so I guess that's, that was new to him, too. What is that? He's getting out. Oh, no, he's not. Oh, uh, <laughs> Jeez. Get away from the rinks. Oh, what the hell? Wow. Holy shit. Nice. Oh, look at that. Oh. Nowhere left to run. <laughs> Face. Ah, <laughs> uh, she's not gonna run anymore. Please let this work. No! Oh! 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 In the face! Oh! In the mush! Uh oh, here comes back <laughs> the big kick. Oh, I thought so. Oh! Oh, oh, oh yeah! <laughs> <Hulk> smash! <laughs> I don't know what to be. <laughs> Is he smiling? I don't know or? what to be. <laughs> don't be a dick. <laughs> it's too late. Look at me. I'm such a dick. It's <laughs> never too late to stop being a dick. <laughs> oh, jeez. <laughs> like uh, golden lesson. 
Ready? Probably not. Oh. Ah. Oh. Oh. He smashed that thing. Nice. Oh. Oh. oh That's finished. Oh, 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 well, it's still in there. Yeah. But it's yeah, busted. Yeah, that thing's shit. pretty busted. <laughs> Cassie! <laughs> <laughs> I'm so proud of you. I feel like I'm hugging Godzilla. <laughs> <laughs> yes. I'm so hungry. That happens. <laughs> Everything, I know. But I really want like a lime. Right? <laughs> Citrus. It's weird. I know. It's not. Oh. <laughs> 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 But he still has all the powers with his suit, though, doesn't right. he? He can still well, do a ton uh, with his yeah, suit. His, yeah, he's his, so pretty yeah. dangerous. Yeah, I mean, he, yeah. Can, he can bend time and do whatever. You still can't see it. It's never over. Nothing is over! Nothing is over! <laughs> Nothing! <laughs> <laughs> You know, Andrew, the one thing I just now thought about when he said that is like, what variant are we dealing with right here? Yeah. Yeah. Is he just oh, going to rebuild he's it He's right about now? to go. He's about to go wreck shit. No, he's going to start ending, ending people. Yeah. Oh, oh, Jesus. He's just vaporizing people. Mm -hmm. oh, nice. <laughs> nice. Uh, she's got the Catwoman skills in her yet. Uh-oh. Oh. Wow. He done. Oh, is he going to take him over? Oh. No. Nope. Just uh, overload him. That guy's done. Let's go. Right now. No. Come on. No. I know. I know. I have to go. Jeez. It's she like just, a video game she for She's just him. snapping them. Oh, shit. Oh, I mean, does he really have a chance? Ah. Ah. Oh. oh. I thought that oh. was going to work for a minute. Yeah. We still don't want to try the old, uh, the old Thanos. Go, go inside him. <laughs> the old up in the suit. How many Avengers I've killed, and you think you can beat me? I am Kang. You, you talk to ants. Well, well here they come. What kind of remember they have uh oh, a lot of technology. What is this? They lived a thousand years in a matter of days. A million million years. I, thought, I think it was a thousand. Oh, was it a thousand? Thousand, ah. thousand years in a day. Well, yeah. so then if it's been a couple days. Yeah. <laughs> Where were these things like an hour ago? <laughs> <laughs> Better late than never, right? Yeah. <laughs> oh. <laughs> My name is Darren. I am not <laughs> 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 Oh, they're on him. Okay, start ripping oh. parts off now. Uh. Wait, so where'd he go? Sorry, I'm late. <laughs> oh, is this you? You were right about me, Cassie. Darren, are you okay? No. Oh, probably not. Darren? I hope. <laughs> you changed your hair. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what to say. Thanks, Scott. You always were a brother to me. I was? Yeah, I was just <laughs> <laughs> a lot has happened today mom where are you i'm in the tower i think i can give us one shot back but we don't have much time 
If we want to go home, we have to go now. Well, where's Kang? I mean, the ants. Why aren't they utilizing the smartness of the ants, you know? Yeah. Uh, well. I think the assumption is that Kang got 86. Come on, let's go! All right, good luck. Good luck. Come on. I don't know. If we didn't see it, it didn't happen. And there's a lot of variants. Yep. So. Thanks, buddy. You did it. Let's go home. Come on, let's just yeah, go. I, I, Don't waste time. Just go. So I say, stop the happy go lucky. Yeah. Just go. All right, so these two are going to battle evenly now. Yeah. Well, is it Kang's suit that gives them the power? Well, I think that, I'm, I'm wondering if that's how they're making they're, it they're seem. They're showing the sparks and stuff. You should have looked the other way. Never been great at that. Oh. oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> He's a little bit out of his league here. Oh, is he getting worked? But you thought you could win. Oh. Uh. I don't have to win. We both just have to lose. Oh, no. Why didn't he put it on King? Yeah, he could have. Oh. Oh, he's getting tied with so, it? Yeah, it's like ripping him apart. Oh, it's pulling him out. Oh, that's interesting. Yeah. Oh, no. Did that portal close? I'm guessing yes. Yeah. Oh, what? Oh, no. Well, I mean, I'm sure Hank and, and company can figure out a way to open it up again. Well, right? exactly. I mean, we got the thousands of ants with all their advanced technology uh -huh. and Hank, who's a genius. Yeah. So that's why I'm slightly confused here. I'm not, not confused, but just pondering why. They, I mean, we're at the end, so they can't do that. But hopefully we'll get some answers. Freedom. Man, there had to be a ton of cameos in the background with all the uh, the characters and whatnot. Oh. Let's go. Another answer for me. <laughs> <laughs> My life doesn't make sense. I used to ask myself a lot of questions about that. You just saved the quantum realm with your family and drank a guy without holes. <laughs> you are the bug. I was wrong. You're the bug man. You get big and small like a big bug. <laughs> just a coffee, please. A twelve dollar. <laughs> twelve dollars. <laughs> There's always someone you can help. Came out of cake making retirement for you. <laughs> he also said something bad was coming and that everyone would die if he didn't get out. Is everyone going to die because of me? Oh my God. What, what did I do? You know what? Welcome. It's probably fine. <laughs> <laughs> Everything's probably fine. Kang's gone. Don't have to worry about that guy anymore. Happy fake birthday, Cassie. Oh. Ugh. <laughs> <laughs> I know they uh, said there's a, a mid and a post. We're late. How many did you call? Eight of us. <laughs> Look at oh, all those berries. Boy. <laughs> oh my oh. god. Oh, that one looked like that's exactly like, like the, the one credits. in the book there. Yeah. Exactly like that one. He did a damn good job though on his. Oh, oh uh, that was boy. a preview. Time is everything. It shapes our lives, but perhaps. <laughs> Jeez. It's him. You don't sound like this terrifying. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> what? Yes. See, this is why I was saying we need to. Well, you guys need to watch Why Wolfie. is Owen Wilson in Because <laughs> he's in it. 
Okay, so oh, he's amazing in it. Yeah, so there. I feel like. Uh, <laughs> what? Feel, Owen Wilson. <laughs> Uh -huh. I feel like we probably did these two a disservice. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe uh, we'll, yeah. have some, we'll have some homework. <laughs> but uh, uh, yeah, so folks, we might have to have them do the six episodes of Loki to uh, kind of tie that little bow on that yeah. for you guys. <clears throat> well, that was Ant Man and the Ant Man and the Wasp. You still had your Quantum Mania. You know exactly what I would expect from an MCU movie with Paul Rudd in it. A lot of fun. <laughs> Uh, in the beginning, you know, I didn't like how they were going after my guy a little bit. You know, saying, oh, like, what have you done lately? <laughs> like, lately, save the entire world twice, you know? That's so how the God world Thanos, works, though, Quinn. What have you done for me lately? That oh, wasn't it's always... enough, so uh, I, I was really feeling for, for Paul Rudd there in the beginning. But, uh, you know, exactly what you would, would expect from a movie like this. All the actors did really good, especially Michelle Pfeiffer had a way bigger role mm -hmm. than I expected. Uh, Michael Douglas was great as always. Uh, still one of my favorite movies with him is uh, Romancing the Stone. He's <sighs> outstanding in that, but just classic what you would expect from him. Uh, you know, it it wasn't perfect. It wasn't without a couple of you know maybe questionable plot holes, but you know at the end of the day, it's a fun MCU movie. I think if you go into it with those expectations, knowing that you're going to see some new characters, I mean, an entirely new world uh, for us to see here with all kinds of different create uh, creatures and different uh, settings, which was really neat. And you know, because from what we saw in the beginning, the quantum verse looked like it was just like a desert nothing nothing yeah. in there and uh it turned out there was a lot more to it than we thought and you know they keep hitting on this multiverse and i just feel that for the mcu that's like the ultimate cheat code that gives them the ability to do whatever they want and whenever they want there's they can bring anybody back they can introduce new characters put different characters and mashups and things like that. So it pretty much gives them the freedom to do just about anything. And I feel that that's what they're really kind of setting up here is the ability to do uh, all those different things that they will essentially have the freedom to do. So this one was a lot of fun. Paul Rudd was crushing it as Ant-Man as always. And uh, I had fun with this one. Answer your thoughts. Well, it was... <laughs> This was so much fun. I I didn't, had no idea that we were going to see Modoc. That was a pleasant surprise. <laughs> yes, he started off bad, but he does eventually help the Avengers in the comics. <laughs> Redemption. So, calm down. Yeah. Calm down. He he goes through all that. Although it wasn't it wasn't uh, who it was in the movie as Modoc. It was obviously George. Uh, no, it was. This was a lot of fun. I loved what they did here, going into the Quantum Mania, like having. The one thing I was I didn't like at first was like how uh, Janet just kept on being hush hush about yeah, everything. Not anything. Like just let everyone know so that way there's nothing that's like surprising. So that way there's no cats out of any bags. <laughs> but Paul Rudd was amazing as always, and then I love the where he's trying to teach Cassie how to jump, kick, jump, yeah. punch, yeah. jump, whatever to help out. Jump A pat. great love. So, surprise cameo by bill murray as lord kyla that was outstanding i never thought i'd see the day with him in a marvel movie but it was amazing he did a great job as always even the little quick cameo of randall park who stumbled upon being in both a dc and mcu movie around the same time mm -hmm. that's amazing to me but i had a lot of fun with this one and learning more and more on on king each time and then seeing the entire stadium filled with king the conquerors i'm just i'm excited to see where this goes and then the uh spoiler if we'll if we'll have the the post credit scene to see owen wilson and, and tom mm -hmm. in the good old black and white days and uh with his old elixir talking days with king the conqueror <laughs> selling I snake oil loved I it really really enjoyed this movie and i'm having a hard time understanding you know diamond dave had said <laughs> <laughs> Wait, you had said when we started that people either loved it or hated it, and like, I'm having a really hard time understanding like how people didn't like this movie. I get there was some frustrations, like tell them what's going on, and now like yep. looking yeah, back yeah. at the movie as a whole, it's like okay, well, she got into some sketchy stuff. She had, uh, you know, a new boyfriend or love interest, uh, you know, in the uh, in the 
the quantum realm. So maybe she didn't want to talk about that. Um, you know, maybe she didn't want to freak him out too much about what was going on. But I, I thought this was a lot of fun. I mean, it started with your typical, like, lighthearted comedy with Paul Rudd. And they did such a good job with that about, you know, now he's famous and he's doing this book. <laughs> the, book tour. the book tour had every, like, cliche. <laughs> so you know. Yeah, everything. <laughs> Don't forget about do. the small yeah. guy. Never, you know, <laughs> underestimate how much you can grow. Oh man, really? Forty? Oh, well, eighty-three well, percent so audience the, score. The, the, the real fans like yeah. the audience. That's what um, matters. What did, let me let me see what the critics said on on Rotten Tomatoes. Mostly lacks a spark of fun that elevated earlier adventures, but Jonathan Majors Kang is thrilling. Uh, the plot's a bit of a mess, said the audience, but overall Ant-Man and the Wasp uh, starts phase five of the MCU with a colorful, creative thrill ride. Eh, okay, so that's, so that's yeah, I think I think yeah. that's spot on. And and to, and in and, 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 and defense of the critics on this, um, you know, it, it, maybe it doesn't have like the, the major like, you know, like Spider-Man or like Iron Man feel to it. But, I you know, part of me feels like that's the, the character itself. And not like, look, just by default, with as far as I'm concerned, and this is just going as a casual Marvel fan, I don't have my own encyclopedia. <laughs> to me, you know, Iron Man and Thor are, are bigger characters than, you know, Ant Man and the Wasp. And mm -hmm. so it's their storylines are going to be different. They're not as, you know, as grand, if I guess, if that's a fair uh, way to put it. But I thought, look, I thought this was a ton of fun. I think bringing the daughter in, you know, was interesting. You know, the way Hank, you know, had the ants cultivated at the end yeah. was absolutely wild. I thought that was a cool touch. You know, I'm trying to figure out how are they going to beat this guy. So I thought this movie was a lot of fun. Yeah, maybe a few, like, plot holes. I think if you sit back and really, like, hyper-analyze, you know, Kang and, you know, the world destroying and, and stuff like that, I think you could probably get nitpicky with it. But as far as just going into a, a movie and, and watching it and enjoying it and having fun, I, I thought this was I thought this was great. Yeah, yeah. I I don't know. I'm still kind of uh, <laughs> conflicted with some of mine. I mean, I did not dislike it. I didn't think it was the strongest film in the MCU. Well, we're, I don't think um, any of us are saying no, that. No, I mean, it's well, certain. I mean, I I'm not saying anything yeah. about you guys. I'm just yeah. giving you my perspective here. I just don't think it's the strongest one. I don't think it's the weakest one. Uh, so I'm kind of right there teetering in the middle. Uh, the my nitpicks, I think it was I don't know if they even made the the YouTube cuts, but uh, I kept saying, you know, wh what is the big deal if Janet tells, you know, everyone about yeah. Kang? That's yeah. like why did we have to get? And I get why they did it. An hour in, that's when they finally, you know, hey, yeah, this the is reveal. it. Yep. But yeah, you know, if I mean, if it was like, hey guys, we got a big problem here. <laughs> okay. okay, Dave. What's the problem? Well, guess what? I can't tell you. <laughs> well, <laughs> well, well, go on. Yep, can't tell you. But uh, that's kind of how it felt like. Is like, all right, all right lead the way. <laughs> well, uh, there's no time. We have to walk over here. Yeah, exactly. Walk so, yeah, so I felt no. like I felt like they forced that a little mm. too much instead of having to. To me, it didn't feel natural because in, in a there's a serious problem in the quantum or wherever for for these guys. We're there. They are all incredibly intelligent. Yeah, they scientists. all have some kind of ability uh, through a suit or whatever it is. Wouldn't it be beneficial to at least give them uh, even just a hint of something? Like you don't have mm -hmm. to sit there and read a novel to them about. Well, you know, thirty years ago, on this day, this is what happened. Uh, but page fifteen. You know, where's page fifteen? Just give them but, the cliff notes. Yeah, yeah I. I Again, all intelligent people, the more knowledge that these people have about, hey, you know, this dude is strong, the X, Y, and Z, maybe you could formulate a plan. So then. Knowledge is power. Knowledge is power. <laughs> and then <clears throat> with the ants, knowing what they could do at the end. Like, why? Are you, and I get it again, you know, I guess you could call this kind of the, the plot mess, I guess. But like. They just whooped some ass at the end. I mean, we could have saved, <laughs> saved a, lot, a lot, lot of lives. We could have saved an hour. But uh, I, I did, though. Time to get them there. Yeah. Well, it took time. It took time, probably. But now knowing with the ants and what they can do, why wouldn't they bring them, you know, at least attempt to bring them back, which we didn't get to see. So I'm assuming they, they didn't, cause given what they told us here. Mm -hmm. I yeah. guess why oh, would you bring those back, back? They're probably taking over the world. <laughs> right. as soon as, as soon as that's what is, I mean. Like, as soon as Pim is gone, 
they're taking over. <laughs> Maybe I'm just going in uh, like way off left field. Uh, that's just kind of where my head's at. So I did it. I, I mean, I did, was entertained. Would mm -hmm. I rewatch it? Probably for a rewatchability factor. Uh, Modoc, I don't know much about, so I'm gonna have to go get educated. Whether it's through Andrew's encyclopedia, there, <laughs> very or small section knowledge uh, through you all in the comments, or just trying to search out some stuff. He does have a cartoon, I believe, on Disney Plus. Well, well, maybe I just have to watch cartoon. Me of what was it? Ninja uh, Turtles? Yeah, yeah. Like Krang. 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 Yeah, that's Krang. what it yeah. reminded me. Yeah, it's of. Krang. If, yeah. if uh, some people did have issues with this film. Would love to read what they were mm -hmm. and why. Don't just say it sucks because it's, you know. <laughs> yeah, elaborate. Yeah. All right. So why did it suck if it sucked for you? But I would probably say I'm middle. I'm still middle of the road. Now seeing it, I wouldn't mind going back and rewatching it and seeing if, you know, the rewatch helps. Be like, oh, yeah. Okay. Now I get yeah. a little mm -hmm. bit more. Or if I just stay in, you know, just middle. middle yeah. Of the I mean, road. I think Marvel has their movies where they almost have movies that they make and their sole purpose to basically be world building and propel the story, the overall well, yeah. storyline forward. This one's that's, King. That's the purpose this, of this movie. This well, you with know? Loki and now with this, it's all about King because they need they they need to build their next great villain after you know Thanos is gone. I do. So they need a big villain. I do want to say, personal stuff aside from Jonathan Majors, we're not here to discuss that, but we are going to discuss his performance. Dude would have knocked it out of the park in here. Mm -hmm. uh, the one thing I, I saw that really set it apart for at least me was his facial expressions. Mm -hmm. Yeah. To me, that was hugely different from hugely different. Well, either way, you know what I mean. Vastly, Grammar vastly hard. different. Uh, vastly different. Drastically different. Drastically it's like, different. It's like there Hulk we go. There is speaking. <laughs> uh, than anything we've seen in Marvel for yeah. quite some time. Um, it was, it, it was so. cool to see a villain who like didn't have to have a bunch of bravado about him and being out there, you know, really like showing off. He just walked into a room and he knew what he could do, and he didn't have to show off about it. Answer: Am I correct in uh, in, in thinking from what I saw here that Kang's power came from his suit? I mean, to to my knowledge, on here through the movie, it's through the suit. I could check the encyclopedia. Yeah. I because I would yeah. I was of let us know sure. because with Michelle she Pfeiffer, if she made it. Michelle Pfeiffer, Janet's character, she made it seem as if he he didn't have the powers, and once they got that that energy core, and his suit came back on, <laughs> then like he got all the power. Mm -hmm. So and and I know obviously you have your Iron Man, you have your Ant Man, certain superheroes where. The power comes from some sort of external device. You have your Captain America's, mm -hmm. you know, where it's, you know, Zero. things like that, where it's, uh, but, you know, that's who he is now. So it's yeah. it's always interesting. But, um, and I'm curious as far as like where he is, suit, no suit, whatever, as far as like the power scale, because from everything that we see, he seemed like, like a pretty serious. Yeah, I mean, he was badass. holding Ant Man up against the wall. And he was you know? only using his left yeah. hand. Yeah. During those yep. hits. There it is yeah. right there. Master of Time Travel suit provides enhanced strength, force field protection, and energy projection, typically armed with futuristic weaponry. Okay. So, so it helps. It, it, it helps, yes. It he helps, still has the ability to mess with time. It, probably, even it, will, it, it provides enhanced strength, force field protection, and energy projection. But the majority of but his he's powers, a time traveler. He's a time to, traveler. So that's why he, his weapons are going to be usually more very futuristic okay that answers that question excellent yeah, yeah i mean i i thought it was really really interesting <laughs> some of the the weaponry that we saw that kang had um because you know I got something to say. uh you, you know it, it that's a, the interesting thing about coming up with these bad guys in alternate universes in these different worlds is always like how are they gonna you know how are they gonna fight against the avengers and what sort of weapons do they have the energy projection i thought was cool mm -hmm. you know the towers that came up with like the rotating laser yeah. guns yeah they S up the ante on that so stuff. big shout out uh, as far as from a creative standpoint for uh, the, i mean they had to build a whole new world i mean that mm -hmm. was another thing like you literally it's not like hey you know it's you know la or new york or, or wherever and you know the avengers are getting in a fight you had to build an entirely new world for them to you know have this this yep. all this take place to to your point there except the intro and the outro 
uh, the beginning and end of this film, this whole thing was <laughs> blue screen CGI. Blue screen. Oh yeah. god, yeah. Outside the actors, yeah. of course. Yeah, well, I mean, yeah. You, you have yeah. some yeah. some set building, <laughs> but they're, pra they're the yeah. small practical. No. Stuff. Yeah, where what sort of? They're sets looking are you at a lot of tennis stuff. balls. Yeah. I think. That, well, for me, well, I'm, I'm, I'm wondering trying to remember. I'm for me, and of course, throw some of the movies down in the comments so I can read them. But I feel like this was like the most blue screen, green screen CGI they've done for one MCU movie where like yeah. almost the whole thing on theatrical release here hmm. was like pure. Yeah, Thor, I mean, Thor Ragnarok felt like it was a little... Ragnarok yeah, could you probably could also, rank... And you can maybe almost argue both uh, Guardians of the Galaxy and we'll see about Volume Well, I feel like well. in here, and what I mean by that is because like... Because those two, you create worlds. You, so that's you have more for. like structure pieces and then blue mm -hmm. i feel like this was the More actors blue. and blue did it feel t did it feel to you guys? and i'm not hating on that by the oh, way I'm no just, did it feel to it you guys like guys. super cgi because it didn't that was another thing where i it had a look of it but yeah, it, did, it wasn't know, but overbearing I, I gotta be you honest, immersed like, yourself yeah, yeah like that's yeah. i thought they once did a pretty good it. job with this like once they were there it was like in the beginning when it was like you know, I was like, mm. okay, this is a little weird. And then once you kind of got into it, then you just felt like you're immersed in this new yeah. world. So I think yeah. they did a good job it, with that. It was like when we watched Avatar, where they went into that whole new world. Yeah. Everything yeah. was totally different. You, know, you immerse yourself. You bring that up, answer, and just real quick, uh, with the tech we saw on this and the effects, I can only imagine what Avatar 2 is going to is gonna be like. <laughs> Way of was, the water. Because that was pretty incredible. But we're talking about Marvel tonight, folks. So this one was a lot of fun uh, for me. I'll just do my rating here while these guys are getting their boards. Um, hey, take a, a big good, one. I'll take a big one. Wait, what? For me, it was a, a nice, fun kind of... Not, I don't even want to say run-of-the-mill because that's kind of a negative connotation, but it was just what you'd expect from a Marvel movie <laughs> of this level, I think, and its place in the MCU. So for me, 3.25 out of 5 answers. A lot of fun, but you know, hey, it's not it's not Endgame. Let's be honest here, guys. You know, there's there's a lot to live up to in only, terms of the MCU. Only Endgame and Infinity War and Infinity War and Endgame. Yeah. Uh, me, I... I loved it. It was Paul Rudd at his best. It was Look at that board. So, <laughs> What's the board? He's, he's compensating. <laughs> <laughs> with, uh, with my board going down. Yeah. Oh, sorry. <laughs> All right. There we go. Yeah. <laughs> Look at on the screen. I love it. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. Thank uh, you, Diamond. <laughs> toss me yours. Yeah, I, like I said, I had a lot of fun with this mm -hmm. one. Was it the best uh, Marvel movie? No, but it certainly was not. <laughs> Love and Thunder. Uh, no, you no. mean Thor Dark World. Uh, Thor Dark World. Wait, Dark what? World is worse. Uh, oh. All right. You yeah. guys thought? Yeah. Yeah. We, didn't, we didn't react didn't to get that. But uh, in any regard, like I said, I had a lot of fun with this one. Love Paul Rudd. Thought it was good action. Kang, an incredible character. So it's a solid four for me. I really like this one. Now, just because I did this score, <laughs> yeah, it, does, does this. it does not mean I hated it, but it does not mean I loved it either. Uh, again, uh, shout out to the cast and crew for all this. I would, would I watch another if they came up with Ant-Man 4? I would. I'm going to oh, say yeah. 2.9 for this one. Oh, I feel see, like, that's not yeah, so I mean, that's, I, that's middle the of the road. You started, yeah, I thought you were going no. like a two, I mean, like three. I don't know. I'm, again, I'm still conflicted because I feel like... This was another, and it is Marvel style to, you know, we're going to set up for the next one. If it, right. If it, uh, there was just, again, some things I, I just want to rewatch and maybe it changes my thought process. It wasn't Paul Rudd. Well, well, that's then. the thing. You know, the cast makes a difference. But it, uh, it is you know, Paul Rudd. Yep. That's, that's the that's, thing. It you know, is perfect Paul Rudd. And Michael yes. Douglas. I mean, yeah, Michelle uh, Pfeiffer. I just don't understand why we don't see, again, I think I said it during the, re, uh, during the, the film. How we? How does no other Avenger like just call up Hank? Like Hank, fix this. <laughs> He's one of the geniuses left. Yes, yeah. right. So well, yeah, Stark's gone. I Stark. would have. I, you know, the one thing it's that the movie left me, wanting, left me wanting more of the, the uh, like the female warrior, yep. like main yeah. character. Oh yeah, from the quantum. Uh, uh, I heard. Uh, I saw her name. Zahura. Um, God, she was so cool. Yeah. It's like I know right, she's from goes. this universe. Yeah, uh, Katie O'Brien. Uh, Katie O'Brien. Jen Tora. Jen Tora. What, what else yeah. is she in? I'm pretty sure she was in Z Nation, and I know well, Diamond just, Dave doesn't think so, but I think she had a on, quick right? like cameo bit with Oceanside in The Walking Dead. So uh, to your point, yeah. 
I wouldn't mind seeing more in Gentora, but Quaz, because he he, he is was, he was yeah, great with the he mind was, reading. I, he, oh, yeah, yeah, the mind reading that he was doing. Yeah. Uh, that was that's awesome. Perfect for a side by side of like what Gentora was doing. Like, give me the number. I'll never tell you. <laughs> it's one, two, three, four. Yeah, <laughs> yeah those good comic too. relief. Yeah. I mean, ah, these are was. these are characters yeah. that are. She was in Z Nation. Yep. Everybody. As well as Mandalorian, so uh, she's okay. she's had herself a pretty good <laughs> couple yeah. of years here with yeah. some Mandalorian love and some. Uh, oh, is she going to be in the new Twister? All right, wow, that's amazing. Well, yeah. uh, what I was <laughs> chuckling about real quick in here is that uh, the scene we might have seen at the end there was uh, King decided to jump into 1901. Wisconsin, known as Timely Wisconsin in 1901, so that could have been that <laughs> scene right then and there that we saw. Which is important That's again, awesome. so maybe Oops, we just sorry. force uh, Oak, and, Oak and Mason Quinn to watch yeah. Loki. There's just a couple episodes so we get them caught up and everything will make a it's little a bit more watch. sense because season watch. two of Loki is coming at in October, I think they said, just a couple days ago. So it'd be great for us to hop on that bandwagon and watch that. So. All right. All right. So there you have it. Another great Marvel film. So for Diamond Dave, Appleton Oak, that's Mason Quinn, and I'm, of course, the answer. Good night, pals.